okay first open oracle vm virtual box okay then we have to start that oracle vm virtual box okay after that it can take some time to open the cloud era load it okay it may takes around 5 to 6 minutes depend upon the system configuration it will load so it opens cloud era so then we have to close this browser clear then we have to open eclipse click on eclipse okay so wait some time it takes one to one or two minutes to open the eclipse from the cloud era bundle we got eclipse lona okay so it takes some time to open eclipse lona so after opening this eclipse lona okay so we have to first i was deleted the previous word count project i deleted that word count project now i have created new project by clicking on file new java project at the project name we have to write the project name is word count then click on next in this we have click on the labels tab and click on add external jar files then select file system under that we have to check user and then lib and then click on hadoop and then click on hadoop okay so in this we have some set of jar files select all the jar files from this hadoop folder then click on okay and again click on add external jar files and click on client in this we have some set of jar files and select all the jar files and then click on okay and then click on finish clear and then you have to expand that one and right click on src and then new class file give the class file name is word count give the class file name is word count okay then click on next clear so so in this java file first we have to copy complete word count program select that one and then copy con copy control c okay copy that complete word count program and then paste in this java file and then save this file by click on control s clear now this program is ready okay successfully saved and then right click on the project click on export and then click on java jar file okay click on next in this click on browse okay so click on browse that means to creating a jar files click on browse and then under click on desktop okay here we give the name is from which name we want to save the jar file just i would like to save the jar file as word count dot jar that's why it's give the name as word count in this w and c r cap letters okay after that click on next and then finish now it creates a jar file under the desktop fine okay next we have to create one sample text file to find the number of words in a file clear so here i was i was already created a text file save that file as sample.txt and then we have to open the terminal okay in the terminal first we have to create a directory in htfs okay for that we give the command is hadoop space dfs space ifn mkdir okay space give the name is slash word in give the name is slash word in and then press enter okay now it is just one warning no problem okay it's created successfully right in hdfs so after that we have to move that sample.txt file into the that odin directory to do that we have to give the command is first 
cd desktop we go to the desktop and then we have to give the command is hadoop space dfs space okay copy from local and then give the file name that is called as sample.txt then our input directory name vodin okay it can return an error i think that means uh, in the copy from local f and l must be a cap letters okay so that is it returns an error okay so we have to edit that copy from local in copy from local just again write copy from local so in that f and l must be a small letters okay f and l must be a cap letters remaining or small letters then click on okay now it successfully copy the text file into the hdfs directory okay then we have to run the jar file by give the command is hadoop space jars hadoop space okay jar space clear jar space the jar file name is word count dot jar word count dot jar space here we have to give our job name in our code we are maintaining the job name is word count that's why we have to providing the job name is word count w and c are cap letters word count then the path of input folder that is slash word in then we are given the path where we want to store the output file okay word in space slash word out okay that is output directory then here enter okay it takes some time to successful executing that jar file okay again it can takes depend upon the system it may takes one or two minutes okay please wait Okay, map at 10 percent, reduce 10 percent. After that, it can successful executed. So now we're getting the like this. That means we're getting the output. Successful executed that job. Then to display the output, we have to give the command is Hadoop space, DFS space, hyphen cat space. Okay. So the output directory is slash word out slash. In slash word out, the output will created at part hyphen R hyphen. five zeros that is the command we have to give in to display the output and then press enter okay now it successfully displayed the count of each and every word in a given sample.txt files likewise you have to check the output we can also check from the browser click on the browser in this url bar we have to enter localhost colon 5w70 click on utilities and then file the browse Our system. In this, we can check word in. That is the directory that was created in HDFS. In that, we have the sample dot txt file. And then again, check word out. Okay. In this, it creates a folder part iphone r iphone five zeros. Click on that one. Click on download. Then save file. Open that file. Okay. It, likewise, also we can check the.